All right, this is question number 10 for the final exam uh, from 2011, ball. So Big John makes tent stakes uh, for every kind of tent. Uh, Big John's nephew, who studied stats at U of M, determined that the model for the length of 40-inch tents okay, is uniform uh, with a range of 38 to 42 inches, and we're actually given uh, a great model for that uh, right here, and that the model for 43-inch tent stakes is also uniformly distributed from 40 to 46 inches. Uh, we have two sketches here. Okay, and then uh, we're told that there's a box found uh, that doesn't have a label on it. So the advice was to pick one tent stake from the box at random, and they decided that if the length was 41 inches or longer, they would decide that it was a, uh, uh, a stake from the 43-inch tent stakes. So the null hypothesis is that the box is filled with 40-inch tent stakes. Okay, in other words, uh, that it's 40-inch uh, tent stakes. And the alternative hypothesis is that the box is 43-inch tent stakes. Okay, it might help to say, right, that the null hypothesis is that it's this distribution over here, and that the alternative hypothesis, just make these notations to help us, uh, is for 43-inch tent stakes. Okay, and the decision rule is that if we pull out a stake and it's 41 inches or longer, we will reject the null hypothesis. Letter A asks us to find alpha. And remember that alpha is the probability of rejecting H0 given that H0 is in fact true. Okay, that's a type 1 error. So we want to find the probability of rejecting the null hypothesis when the null hypothesis is true. And when the null hypothesis is true, that means we're working with 40 inch, the distribution for 40 inch tent stakes. So in this distribution, we want to find the probability of rejecting the null hypothesis. And we will reject the null hypothesis, right? Our decision is reject if the uh, stake is 41 inches or longer. So what we need to do is find the probability of finding a 41-inch tent stake or longer under the distribution where the null hypothesis is true, which is this distribution. Okay. And to find the probability of a tent stake of 41 or longer, I'm just going to take this area under the curve. Okay. And that's just going to equal, if I write that down here, 42 minus 41 times the height, which is 1 over 4, which just comes out to be 1 over 4, or 0.25. Okay, letter B says for this decision rule, compute the statistical power. Okay, so remember that power is the probability that I'll reject H0 given that the alternative is true, or that H0 is false. Okay. Well, if the null hypothesis is false, then that means this is the distribution I should be working with, right? If the null hypothesis is false, then I'm looking at the alternative hypothesis. Okay. And to reject the null hypothesis, that means I'm going to pick a stake that is 41 inches or longer. So I'm just doing the same thing. What's the probability in this distribution of getting a stake that's 41 inches or longer. Okay. So I want this area under the curve. That's going to give me 46 minus 41, and the height of this distribution is 1 sixth, okay. which gives me 5 uh, over 6. And if I write that out, that's going to be 0.8333. Okay. I'm going to clear that.